I'm not here because Kalpana Chawla was an Indian. I'm here because the seven were far above all orders. They represented human being, the finest that we can produce. The difference between tragedy and triumph, a mere 16 minutes from what would have been considered great victory. And I had lived your life in a Christian way God would want to live your life. I mean, any major tra tragedy is, is, is horrible, but, you know, when it's the people that you live and work with, it's, it's horrible. You know, it's just really sad. And how it affects everybody's life is just... But anyway, he is a Christian, and, and are they... I don't know all the astronauts, but I know Mike, and I know uh, 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 Rick, and I know their families, and, you know, I know he's... He's in heaven, you know, so that's some consolation, you know, but it's still, it's still tough, you know, when, when unexpected things happen. Most interesting to the investigators? Well, those teams have actually already been in place. What I am saying is that common sense tells us, as well as the people from NASA, there was radioactive material on board. There was also volatile fuel on board. The additive that has to be placed into the fuel to keep it from freezing up at, at uh, temperatures in space uh, has a potentially dangerous uh, reaction point. So there are things that, that could exist. Those things may have burned up on re-entry as well. I'm not telling you that there is a definite factor out there, but I am certainly not trying to dismiss the fact that caution should be used, and I don't want our public thinking that it's okay to go out and, and handle this debris uh, or even get in close proximity to it just for their own well-being. <laughs> 